and your life. Hey food lovers, welcome to Neri's Kitchen. Today we have a returning guest and this time he's got a bigger meal to share. If you've guessed Coach Wilson, aka The Wiz, you've guessed right. As most of you know, Wilson has entered a bodybuilding competition known as the VDC Natural Show on July 18 and has been working tirelessly to hit his goal weight. The Wiz will be, whop will be whipping up a sample meal plan of what he eats to stay lean. And so far, he's lost 20 pounds since being on this plan and wants to stick to his weight until the show. He plans to do some modeling in between other shows in October as well. So if you're curious to see how he'll be staying so shredded until then, follow his story on Facebook. For now, he'll be showing us his protein French toast, stir fry ground beef, air fryer skinless chicken thigh salad, and a protein dessert. Everyone, please let's welcome back Wilson. Wilson, whoa, whoa, whoa. Hey guys, <laughs> welcome, welcome, welcome. Anyways, I'm glad that I'm back. This is my second time here with Neri's yes. Kitchen. Uh, I think a lot of things have changed now. And we're gonna you're skinnier do skinnier now. I think I'm skinnier no, you're now. Not skinnier. No, no, skin no, 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 no. Shredded. Shredded, shredded and leaner. Yeah. That's what it is. Am I right, Nair? <laughs> yes. Yeah. Yes. So as what Neri said, uh, I am at the VDC Natural. It's gonna be on July 18th. I have two competitions that I'll be doing. That's the physique and classic physique show. So I'm gonna wear the short shorts and I'm gonna wear the long shorts. But anyways, I what thought we're, you're wearing the underwear. <laughs> I am wearing the underwear too that you guys <laughs> that you guys saw. But first things <laughs> first, everyone always wants to know what does the Wiz eat? Yes. So the first thing that I'm gonna show you, cause I'm such a busy guy with Fit Club and everything that I'm doing in my life and with kids and with family, this is what I do. Let's show them what okay. we got. All right, so the first thing that I'm gonna show you guys is, the first thing is air fryer. So I'm gonna take the air fryer, take this, right? And I got my chicken. Do we have a knife in there? Yes, we have a knife. Thank you. And I have, I'm not gonna wash this. Chicken, skinless thighs. All I'm gonna do is, I'm just gonna put them all on top. I'm not gonna spray them because I have no time to spray. And because this is the air fryer, guys, hit up Rick Mancher for this, all right? They're for, called the Two Buff Dudes, actually. Yeah, the, <laughs> oh, the Two Buff Dudes, yeah. yeah. Hit up the Two Buff Dude, RJ Padua and Rick Mancher, if you guys want this so badly, okay? And what you do is you get the uh, chicken thighs. I really don't add any seasoning. I'll tell you why later on. But what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna put, put it inside the air fryer. And this is the best thing about this. You're gonna close it. And how do you use this? You're gonna put custom, right? Yep. Custom, uh, about 15 minutes, that's correct. Press this. Yes. And then after that, go to 375 degrees. Oh, ooh, 375, right? Yep. And then press it again. There we there go. go. Leave it. And then you set it and forget it. Set it and forget it. Now, best thing, I gotta wash my hand because I touched chicken. The next thing that we're gonna be doing is stir fry ground beef udon noodles. Mm. Ooh. So that's what we're gonna be doing. I have the pan fry right over here. Bang. How do I turn this on? Oh, okay. So we have to use this burner because this one is small. Okay. Okay. So you just push it here. All right. And then how high do you want the setting? A medium. Medium? Just like medium. Six? Yeah, sure. Okay. Six is good. We have the boiling water already prepared for you guys that we need to do. What we're going to do is I'm going to take the udon noodles that we have here. You guys can get this at any udon noodles. The best thing why I took this is bang for your buck, two seventy-five for a package of one, two, three, four, five of these, all right? For five. For five, yeah. And the thing is, for one package, it's 200 calories for one udon noodle, right? No way. One yeah. package is one, 100 calories. 200, two, sorry, 290 oh, two. for one. Okay. But the thing is, though, the fat says one gram. That's mm. all you need. So this is going to be your high carb, right? So I'm going to cut it open. That's what you're going to do. You're going to get the udon noodles, right? You're going to put it in the, in the boiling water. Wilson. Oh, sorry. You put we in the boiling water. Online. We have Mark. He says, that's my son. Yes. <laughs> Thank you, Pops. Yeah. I miss you. <laughs> we'll see you soon, Pops. I'm showing them. I'm Mark, Pops, I'm going to show you the best thing, all right? Don't worry about it. He was on anyway. the show a few weeks ago. I know, and he was showing me up. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> Anyways, um, we can use this one is, we got, guess what? My favorite thing, extra, extra lean ground beef. Uh, yeah, extra lean ground beef because extra extra lean ground beef is a little bit more so I'll go more for extra lean ground beef what we're gonna use is if you don't have any oil you can use coconut oil or you can use Pam spray right but ooh, 
there we go. Pam spray kept on going. See, that's how the best thing about this. I thought it was like going. But we'll use Pam spray. Very simple to do. You're going to Pam spray it. One, two. And that's uh, preheated already. Let, let that Pam spray cook a little bit. Um, do we have any fork for the noodles? Yes. We'll have to say hey to Corette. Hey, Corette, thanks for tuning in. Thank you, Corette. She's been, our, she's been our top fan for the last few weeks. Really? Corette has been tuning in from... No, I don't think she's local. No? No, I don't... I can't remember. I think she's from the state. Yes. She's from the... Tell me where you are. Where do you live, Corette? <laughs> I think you're from the states, right? Is she from the states? I think she is, yes. Okay, so <laughs> anyways, we're going to, uh, this only needs to be cooked for about three to five minutes, okay. all right? So now we're going to put the lean ground beef in, all right? I'm not going to put any seasoning right now because the first thing I'm going to do is I'm going to cook the ground beef, right? Okay. So you're going to put it all in. Boom. Pow. Hopefully that's I'm going to turn it up try, Yeah, turn it up a bit. Yeah, we're going to cook it up. it up. Yeah. Oh, Dale says he thought that you were his son. Who? Dale Willems. Oh, really? <laughs> <laughs> okay, so who's your daddy then? <laughs> Holy cow. Oh, pops, come on now. We're going to be like, uh, they're going to be asking about so many questions about us. You know what I mean? Do we have a uh, spatula? Spatula, yes. Yes. Okay, uh, like this? Uh, yes, thank okay. you. So, with the lean ground beef, uh, as you see, we're cooking three things at the same time. Very fast. Uh, we're gonna cook the ground beef first, and then after that, uh, we'll also make my other way is the pancake. I mean, the, the French, French toast. toast. Pancake, French toast, you know what I mean? It's the same stuff for me, but what we're gonna do is, sometimes I don't like seasoning my ground beef, but uh, for you guys, if you want seasoning, you can add some salt and pepper on this. Uh, do you add garlic? Uh, yeah, salt, pepper, garlic. Okay. Um, technically, I'm pretty bland. Not me, I'm not bland person. I'm just I'm just saying every food I eat is bland. So everything is really quick and fast. So while the, the meat is cooking, right, the noodles are starting to be cooked a little yes, bit more. You want it more higher? Uh, on the noodles? Yeah. Uh, I'm gonna take a look at the texture soon. It should be okay. almost there. I don't want it to be cooking too much because we're gonna put that inside the uh, the pan. I don't really need to measure this right now because the thing is though, thankfully we'll measure everything shortly after so let that cook and after that we can start doing the protein dessert oh okay. sorry french the toast? french toast okay see what i mean and just keep on going leave that for a few minutes you need to have a weight scale on so let's go oh, we gotta turn it on on there, there we, go. we go turn that on see how i'm going back and forth as a cook and my sous chef. So what oh, I want you to, chef, yes. my sous chef will be here while she gets okay, this cooked it, yeah. out. All right. Thank you, sous chef. <laughs> and what we're going to do is we're going to have a bowl right here. We're going to set it uh, to zero. So, uh, sorry. Uh, hold on. I got to put that back to ground. Set it to zero. You need 200 grams of egg whites, right? So get your egg whites. Pour it in. Measure. There it is, 200 grams of egg whites. Then after that, you need one scoop of your favorite protein. Everyone, there's uh, Gorilla Jack, thank you so much, buddy. That uh, They're the ones who supplied all of this for our pro protein uh, French toast. So you need one scoop of this. This is about 140 calories, 2.5 grams of fat. And the protein on this is 26 grams of protein. So all you do is you put it in. That's it. Oh, the noodles are done. So we're going to take that out. One sec. I'll put this in the freezer again. One more. And you. And I'll take this out. This is done? Yeah, okay, this one's done. Off. And what you do is I try not to burn the thing. We got this. And we're just going to set it. There you go. Go on. All right, udon noodles, leave it there. Boom. Beef okay, done too. Beef's done too. Get your frozen vegetables. This is so fast. Do you drain your beef or not? 
Uh, for now, let's leave the fat on. Uh, okay. Do we have scissors? Yes. Yes. Thank you, Susha. You're welcome, Chef. Uh, that's how we do it here. <laughs> we have to prep everything and go fast. Exactly. So everything is already ready to go. Look at this. You're going to put the vegetables in. We don't have time. We have to go We don't have time. I don't have time. <laughs> so I got to cook everything already. Well, you have several jobs too, right? Oh, I have, have several, several jobs. Several things. things. On the go. Yeah. So let's put all the vegetables in there. Okay. There you go. I got no time to waste. Exactly. The thing but is though, all of this thing will should should take you for me when I'm going to work, it should take me like 10 minutes to prep everything, all right? Um, when me and Ari were talking uh, uh, backstage, she was asking me if uh, I like fresh uh, fresh uh, fresh cooking. I said I do. I don't like freezing anything. If you're asking me if I meal prep, no, I wake up and I cook everything, okay? And then I eat it. That's how I like doing it cuz I like it fresh. Now, when I go to work, or whatever I'm putting in my Topperware, I have this nice, um, what is it, uh, container that keeps mm -hmm. everything hot. Okay. So that's when I go to work, and all of a sudden it makes it feel so good. I just have to microwave a little 30 seconds, and then it's ready. Got it. See? So you don't do your batch cooking because you like your food fresh. That's correct. So I'm going to eat it. all of this. Trust me, I haven't eaten yet, so this is the best thing to Wait, do. Wait, you're going to eat all of this? I'm going to eat it all. Oh, Why wow. not? Why Are not? Give me some? Well, I'm going to give you some, too. Oh, yeah, we, ha we have to save some for Jerome. <laughs> yeah, we got to have to save some for Jerome. So let's let this cook for a little bit, right? Okay. Uh, we'll put some salt and pepper. Uh, salt and pepper? Yeah. Okay. And a little bit uh, like your gar garlic. Oh, garlic? garlic? Yeah, garlic salt, powder? pepper, and garlic powder. Yeah. Okay. So, this is what happens when it's someone else's kitchen and you're trying to figure out what it is. This is about a teaspoon, one teaspoon, or a pinch of salt. You know what? Mark actually knows my kitchen. That's good. He knows where the cups and plates are and seasoning are. Well, that's good for him. <laughs> yeah. Pops. Like, thank God, you know, you, you are here more than me. <laughs> so I don't, uh, it's okay, Pops, I understand. You, you were cooking those uh, vibrant foods, am I right? So it's all right. I understand that. But I'm always on the go, you know what I mean? So the best way to do it, on the go. So let this cook a little bit, a little bit longer. And okay. we're gonna get you have another uh, fork. Another fork? Yes, I do. Yeah. Just over here. So we're gonna go back to the protein. All right, there we go. We're gonna whisk. I don't have a whisk, but use the fork, you know. Eggs, mix, 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 yada, 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 et cetera, et cetera. If you guys have any questions, go ahead and answer away what you wanna know about what the whiz does or uh, what, what kind of things he does. Type away. I'm here, me and Neri, my sous chef is going to tell you all about it. Okay? okay, so how did you lose 20 pounds? Ooh, okay, seriously. so seriously. <laughs> yes. I ate good food, I worked out every day, do those 30 minute workouts at Fit Club, and you look shredded like me. Ooh, okay. Oh, well, no, no, no. Uh, okay, so work out 30 minutes, eat good food, okay. and you'll be shredded. Okay, so... Uh, 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 so, uh, the first thing that I did was in 2018 or 2017, 2018 I was 230 pounds. Um, back then, Neri uh, met me in 2014 when it was MLT days. Yes. And technically, I was just skinny dude yes. who was just loves cardio. Yes. And I was a cardio guy. Yeah. Loved cardio, enjoyed cardio. And MLT back in the day wasn't doing those 30 minute workouts. Mostly, likely, you were doing sports conditioning. Yes. That's what it was. Mm -hmm. So, I love the sports conditioning because I love loved playing basketball. What Neri was saying, he was big. But the thing is, though, he had so much energy yes. and had good cardio and yes. a good heart. So, yes. I mean, like, we just kept on going. Like, if you ever challenge me, don't challenge me because I'll say no. Because I don't like being challenged. Because <laughs> the thing is, though, it's you versus you. Right, Big Mama? That's right. That's big right. Mama. And if you want to be 1% better, right, RJ? You got to work with you. That's it. That's right. But yeah. you, you must like a little bit of a challenge, too, right? You know what? My mind is all about challenging me. That's it. that's it. I don't want to challenge anybody because the thing is, though, what I put for myself is what I put for myself. So, mm -hmm. for example, we were talking about, like, uh, the mental game, mm -hmm. like Kobe mentality, a.k.a. everyone says Kobe mentality. Yeah. I got that Kobe mentality. I've had it before. The thing is, though, I don't like to show it, but when I have to do it, I will do it. So, for example, to lose 20 pounds, A, you have to have determination, all right? Yes. Right? 
you also have to be willing to sacrifice a lot of things, right? So if you're telling me what I sacrificed, I sacrificed all my sweets. I sacrificed all my, uh, what, what is it? There's many things. Uh, you even track your cream. I track my cream. Uh, I track everything, guys. He like, weighs. He actually has a scale in his backpack yep. that he carries around and yep. weighs everything, which yep. is good, you know? Oh, well, yeah. Mm -hmm. and, and also, when I go out to restaurants, whoever goes with me, it's already in my fitness pal. So I anything from the keg or anywhere from uh, McDonald's or anything like that, I take a look to see what I can eat, eat mm -hmm. that fits into my fitness pal, that fits into my macronutrients that's how i follow my thing and that's so how i follow my diet driving yourself then really no. you're just tr you're keeping track of what you're putting into your body 100 percent. and you're pre -planning. that is correct so and the thing is though i'm not a meal prep kind of guy because the thing is though i don't like eating the same thing even though you guys see me eating this stuff yeah. technically i can eat this with rice this looks good already yeah <laughs> see and it's it's really simple it's really easy i should have put more udon but uh, this will we'll, we'll be okay with that okay this is already ready to go. Do you have a bowl? A bowl? Yes. Yeah. Bowls are here. Um, let's put it in this big bowl. Yeah. So okay. what we're going to do is, you see this udon is already cooked. Just going to put it in here like this. First serving. This is my serving right here. Okay. Uh, either or what you want to do is, because this is already cooked, right? So you can either, if you have more noodles, you can add it on. If you have less noodle, then you can just... Uh, like you know add it onto the pot but what I would like to do is I'll take some of this and move it here and if Neri has rice then you can eat it with rice either or same thing so uh, let's see if this is cooked though a few more minutes give it a few more minutes to go and how's our chicken of course leave it oh yeah we're, we're supposed we're to forget it but forget if you're asking it. we have two more minutes left two more so, minutes left yes two more minutes left. that's good we have so, some friends online. We have Lily who just popped on. Hi, Lily. Hey, Lily. How's it going? Emily's online as well. Oh, Emily's in. Hey, Em. How's it going? But we got some West Siders in yeah, there, too. Yeah, we do have some West Siders. Yay. They know the West Side. The Wiz. Always with that magic plan. <laughs> if they say, if you're not dying, you ain't trying, all right? So just keep on moving. That's what I keep on saying to them out the West Side. Yeah, so, yeah. Emily's asking, what's your take on soy sauce? Do you ever add that? Oh, soy it depends. Sauce. It depends. Uh, a package of soy sauce is okay. Uh, there are low sodium soy sauce that you guys can get, which is a lot more easier than just getting the regular soy sauce. But in my take, um, uh, I don't add soy sauce. I put sriracha sauce and I put other sauce. Now, if you're wanting to buy a sauce that you want to do, go to Gorilla Jack and get their sugar-free, uh, sugar sweet and spicy. One of the best things to have. And you can add that on your thing. All right, so first meal is done. I'm gonna add this. I usually weigh everything, but you guys already know I put it in already on the macros. So You'd um, weigh your beef over your noodles, you mean? Oh yeah, everything. But as of right now, we're not gonna do that. I'm just gonna mix it all in. This looks like um, like koya almost. Yeah, but just very healthier. Yes. Okay, so we'll leave that. You can turn that off. This okay. is ready to go. Boom, okay. boom. Uh, I usually eat this with chopsticks. There's a number one right there. Boom, done. That's your first one. Stir fry beef noodles. And then you add the sauce over it? Yes, okay. later on. We'll eat later that on. later on. This okay. is for my taste. I usually eat this with chopstick, guys, so <laughs> I'm, I'm not a fork. But chopstick. you know what? Using chopsticks, right? First of all, it looks cool when you're using it. And yeah. secondly, it actually helps you eat slower because you're enjoying your food more. Yeah. Right? Do we have, have another pan? A pan? Yeah. Yes. Um, one of those. This one. I don't have chopsticks for you. Oh, it's okay. Don't worry. So now we're going to use, we're going to be, is this done already? Yes. Okay. So Thank French you. toast will be the last one to do. Okay. So get your prepared salad you have another bowl oh another bowl yeah one more bowl like that i okay. think it's up here right uh oh. you can use this white bowl here oh nice oh okay so your salad guys i can't use this because it's uh, dirty yeah sanitary wise look at this compliments per one bag or two cups is 85 grams i don't really i don't i don't measure you don't measure salad. I don't measure <laughs> i don't measure greens okay if you wanted to, there is like next to no calories. Yeah, there's really nothing. This is your like salary. Like probably 25 calories. Probably. 
Okay. I don't really care. Yeah. <laughs> this, you know what? These things go in like for, what is it called? Uh, 30 minutes. Something like that. There's your full salad right there. Is the chicken ready? Yes. It's okay. Ready. Uh, do we have a cutting board? Yeah. It's just, uh, here, I'll grab you the right. cutting Thank board. You. Thank you, Susef. You're welcome. I got a knife. Let's get the chicken out. Oh, give that a few more minutes. Oh, a few more minutes? Yeah, a few more minutes. That's okay. not cooked yet. So let's turn it over. Yeah. A few okay. more minutes. And this one, you turn it on how? Oh, okay. So um, you just want to oh, turn on power. Yeah. Press the burner and then how, however so, how you want uh, it. Okay, yeah, we'll put that to low because it's going to be, yeah. Cook that a little bit longer. What? Five minutes? Uh, Six? Put seven? it ten. 10? 10, yeah. You can, I like it more crispy. Oh, you like it crispier. Yeah, so put it at 390 degrees. Uh, yeah, there we go. Okay. Let's get it crispy. So while that's going on, we're going to put, we're going to, once that's done, we'll put the chicken into our chicken salad later. Okay. That'll be ready to go. See, three things. Now let's make the French toast. Protein French toast, guys. So you need pan spray. Oh, there you go. Right. Uh, this serving is for four slices of bread. Is this what you would typically eat though? Four slices of bread? Yeah. Yeah? Yeah. Four slices of bread. So if I'll you guys... four slices of bread. Yeah, four <laughs> slices of bread. This is the best thing for you guys. If you guys are waking up early in the morning and you're doing your cardio, mm -hmm. right? This is your pre-workout pre meal. Pre-workout. Pre-workout, right? For me, it's a pre-workout because the thing is though... About uh, four slices of bread is about one, two, four hundred calories, mm -hmm. right? So if you're doing that uh, live virtual thirty-minute workouts, and usually guys, you get you burn around three hundred to four hundred calories if you guys. So you've already put it in, plus you've already have your protein inside, Got and it. makes you full and ready to go. I like that. See, right? And it tastes like dessert. It tastes like dessert. Yes, and you can always add on what you like, like. Gorilla Jack, thank you so much. A zero calorie <laughs> pancake. So add as much as you want. Bernard, thank you. <laughs> I got you, bro. <laughs> <laughs> so go to Gorilla Jack on Main if you want your supplements. Yes, yes. Wait, what's their exact address? Does it say? Uh, it doesn't, but they're on Main Street. They're on Main Street. Oh, no, it does say 1665 Main Street. 16, six, uh, 1665 Main Street. Bernard, there you go. I got you. <laughs> And any of those Fit Club people out there, you get a discount from, from Gorilla Jack. Just remember that, okay? Say the Coach Wiz, Fit Club, or RJ sent you, or any of us sent you. There. There you go. Okay. So, um, I'm going to leave it here. These four slices is all you need. I usually get the bigger ones, but like you're going to just dip it like so. I'm just going to put this bread right here. Ooh. You're going to bring it to the pan. I'm just gonna cook it for a bit. Maybe put it a little bit higher. What is it? How do you? Higher? Okay, you want. Seven. Like seven, probably. Seven? Yeah. Okay. So let that cook and then you're gonna fold it back and forth, okay? Okay. And then that's one toast. Uh, let's get. This is gonna be fast. Yeah, I'll watch you. I'll, I'll watch this. You sure? Yeah, I'll take care of it. You have something too. Yeah. No, yeah. no, it's my job to help you. Yes, thank you, Susha. <laughs> you're welcome, Chef. <laughs> so you can, you can put all your. Uh, what is it? Should be about four four toasts in there. All you want to do is just like, you know, put it in, mix it all together, soak it in. Get all that egg whites and protein mixed all together. Very simple stuff. I probably think I can put one more bread in here. Let's do it. There's Let's three do people it. here. Holy cow. All right. Is this ready? Uh, let me take a look. Okay. I think it looks, actually it, it's not ready, but it's, it's protein. You have to watch protein. Yeah, that's the thing. Because uh, it burns if you don't watch yes. it. Yes. Um, technically, it's more likely like I want it to be a little bit brown, a little bit in between. Got it. So let's see how it looks. No. Oh, no. Couple no more just minutes? keep it more minutes. Yeah. You want it, you see how that browning is? Yep. At the thing? You yep. want that to be a little bit brown. Got it. Okay. And once that has a little bit brown and a little bit, but crust into it, then you mm. put it onto the plate. Mmm, okay. And then we got the next ones coming in. Okay, I have room. 
She has room. I have room. There we go. Okay. So yeah, uh, the thing is though, with uh, this French toast thing, we got uh, 200 grams of egg whites, we got uh, 26 grams of protein, and we got four, AKA five now, because Neri said that we can add a little bit yes. more in there. <laughs> Bing, bang, bada boom. And everyone says carbs are a bad thing. Hell no. Who says that? You know, in moderations, guys, in I think moderation. people who don't eat carbs say it's a bad thing. Well, you know, <laughs> you want to be keto diet? You know, diets, my diet. If you're following, what you need to follow is just eat healthier, okay? And understand what your body is. Like, know how to maintain yourself, okay? That's the hardest thing. Like, once you figure out who you are and what you like to eat, technically you eat the same thing every day. Am I right, Neri? Yes, I eat the same thing every day. I eat the same thing every day. The only thing why you eating some stuff that you feel like you want it is because it's that craving. And when you want that craving, you want it so badly. Just like ice cream, Chapman. Like RJ. <laughs> you know what? He actually eats ice cream or Chapman's ice cream every day. We have it. We always have it in our fridge. You know why? Because it fits his macros. It fits his it's macros. It's macros. That's right. So see what I mean? So it, it's nothing wrong. It's nothing wrong to have that. Look at that. It's is looking this good. good or you this want... is good. This okay. is good. This okay. is good. Okay. So Wilson, how do you uh, fight the cravings? If how you do... have cravings. I. What cravings? What cravings? Okay. What, are you, what are you talking about cravings? You know what? It's the mentally prepared. See, I have a show to go. And the best thing about it is if you have a goal and you set your goal and you put your mind set to it, then there's no cravings at all. Am I right? Am I right, Neri? So your craving is this thing. Well, the craving is this. <laughs> the, the craving is <laughs> Oh, of course. The cra start. she, she, she started it. The craving is... <laughs> no, I mean, the, the thing is for me, uh, some days you do have that low. But then all of a sudden you got to think about what's the purpose? What got is it. the purpose? What is the purpose that you're trying to do, right? RJ always has these, um, what is it, on IG to, to help you guys out. This is the purpose, right? I have a show. And when the show is over... I have another goal. And when that goal is over, I have another goal. So set yourself up with goals that you want to pursue. Hey, underwear model soon? Why not? It's whatever, what makes you feel happy that you keep on going, right? <laughs> no matter what. Just push yourself so through to it. just keep having goals and keep looking forward to something. Oh, yeah, of course. I mean, like, you got to be happy with your life, right? Yeah. I mean, like, in general, um, best thing about it is what I've learned uh, from doing it is that I'm happy. I'm way more happier. Uh, my wife enjoys the body, right? Uh, the kids enjoy the all the time spending time and and just having fun. We generally the more healthier you are, the better you can move, the better you can uh, do a lot of things. My goodness, back then the day my knees were killing me, my back was killing me. I mean, 225 to 230 pounds of weight on you is not good on your body. All right. DJ Sinigang is going to be well, there soon. Trust me. Have you ever thought about carrying a sack of potatoes? It's, I, it's, it's heavy. heavy. It's and heavy. That's only like, what, 5, 10 pounds? But yeah. it's heavy. It's heavy. So that's crazy yeah. that you've lost, you know, two sacks of potatoes. Yeah, I lost two sacks of potatoes, and I hate potatoes. <laughs> yeah. okay. I do. I don't yeah. like potatoes. You hate potatoes. Yeah. We're just talking I love, about this. Okay, I love, uh, the thing is, why I hate potatoes is because I like French fries, right? So you got to think about it yourself. That's a mental game for me. If I eat too much French fries... I'm just going to go bloat it up. You know what I mean? So I say, yeah. say I don't like potatoes, but I love potatoes. But, you know, tomatoes, potatoes, tomatoes. <laughs> Did I say it right? Yes. Uh, yeah, that's right. Tomatoes, the tomatoes, thing. the same thing. <laughs> so, yeah. All right, we're going to put the, yeah, the next one the in. Last one. Oh. No, oh, you no. said you wanted extra. I said I wanted extra. You wanted extra. I think we can have one more in there, too. <laughs> this protein, because I think Jerome wants, the, wants to eat. Yeah, I'll be eating and sleeping. That's another thing. Sleep is very important, right? Yes. So everyone always watches me on IG. This is, uh, I'm going to tell you guys. I sleep at around 9 to 9.30, all right? And I wake up around 4 o'clock. Usually 4 o'clock, but technically 3.30, 3 o'clock. I, I have to go to the bathroom. I drink a lot of water. And if you're going to tell me how much I drink, about almost 6. 6. 6 or, liters? Yeah, 6, all right? Wow. So I have those 2.2 jugs, right? I drink one, two, three of those a day. Sometimes four. Wow. 
and I drink a lot of water. I love water. Yeah, and, and when I'm doing all those, uh, what is it, 30-minute uh, workouts, and Jen killed me today with Ninja Strong, guys. If you were on Ninja Strong, there was 40, I think it was 40, video, 40 people there. We killed it, and keep on going, no matter what. I just want you guys to know. 40 people on Zoom, right? 40. 40 people on, 40 Zoom. on Zoom. 40, yeah, wow. on Zoom. It was killer, and we killed it. Good job, So, Jen. yeah, good job, Jen. Sis, killed it. Yeah, that's perfect, too. That's perfect? Yeah. Let me just flip this over. Those two are perfect. Okay, there we go. Now we got two more left. Two more, because I wanted extra. Yeah. This looks so yummy. Yeah, I, I this is my favorite. <laughs> yeah, use up everything. That's protein right there. Yeah, that's protein right there. You ain't, you ain't gonna, don't waste protein. Don't waste it. Don't no. waste it. That's just silly. <laughs> yeah, don't waste protein. Protein goes in, you're ready to go. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. But you can use any protein powder, right? That's like correct. Vanilla any, or... and you know what? There's a great one. Uh, the yummy, yummy protein has these French toast uh, oh, yes, uh, ones. Yummy. Yeah. But uh, I love them. But you can use any protein and mix it yourself. Okay, look at this. The chicken. Let's check a look. Oh, perfect. Now that the chicken is done. Yeah. Do you want to? Oh, no, good. no, I'm okay. good. I'm good. Look at that. Yeah, that's what I do too. Wow. <laughs> Technically, for me, I worked. Um, uh, in a restaurant before back in the day, you know, everyone starts off, off and so it's very simple for me to get these going uh, I'm gonna use the knife. I'm gonna cut it into small pieces Ooh. Technically I weigh these and put them oh, on weigh? the weigher so you weigh the cooked weight. Yep. Yeah, and then okay. I put it in the salad. I would do 200 grams of these, but the thing is, oh, who cares? I think that's 200 grams anyways. That is it? Looks, that looks like 200. The 200 grams? We can always weigh it, but... Let's weigh it then. Okay. Check it out. Get a... Let me taste it. Let me taste it. Oh Remember, God. it's not seasoned because Wilson likes to add his dressing on top of it. Yes. Uh, what but I try... you could season it if yeah, you want to. Yeah, if you to. want to season it, then you can season it. But I don't really like seasoning my chicken because what I do is I like to add my sauce at the, at the end. Actually, pretty good with no, no system. Yeah, well, and you chop it up into small pieces. Yada, yada, yada. Okay, so let's see how much grams of this is, all right? Mm -hmm. I'm going to put it right here, I guess. No, here, here. Are you sure? Okay. It's I think near... it looks like 200. You say it's 200? Let's see. Okay, so it's 130, 100, oh my, I think you're, you are so right. Hold on, hold on. Oh, no, no, wait, 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 wait. See, yeah. yeah. Oh, no, 200. 200. Look, look at that, Neri, Neri yeah. killed it. 200 grams on that that's chicken. How, that's how you know I weigh my food. Yeah, there you go. <laughs> so you're going to put it right there. There, meal number two, done. Meal number three. Oh, we're just about done. All here. right, meal number three, done. And I'll show you how we're gonna plant. And guess what? We're gonna do meal number four, dessert. You guys ready for the dessert? Come over here. Now I gotta turn it off again. How do I do this? So it's on grams, set, set. Do you wanna just put it at zero? Yeah. Oh my gosh. Okay, hang on. Oh yeah, turn, turn it off. off. Turn it, you know, it's been doing weird things. I've had the scale forever. Forever, Maybe it's time ever. to get a new scale. All right, so we're making protein dessert with Chapman's ice cream, all right? Yes. So one, two, we got French toast ready to go. We're almost there, and we're going to have some fun with this. All right, so what you're going to do is set this to zero again. You have one scoop of protein, same thing, chocolate protein. Here we go. We, we won't put the ice cream yet. Oh, no. okay. I'll put it it's going to be for once we put this in. Oh, on top. Yeah, it. on top. It's just for a little bit of a... So we got the protein. Put it in. Bring that to zero. We got almond milk. You need one-fourth of almond milk. One-fourth of almond milk. And you measure everything. Yeah. You got to. Yeah, I have to. If I don't measure, then I don't know. I don't know what I'm putting in my body. Yeah, you can't eyeball it. You I can't eyeball. You have to measure. Really have to measure. Yeah, you really you do. You got to have to measure. If you don't measure, then you're not going to be in the 
you know, you don't, you're, you're not going to get the abs. I'm not going to show you the abs. Show the abs, uh, jeez. He wants to, yeah. <laughs> just, just a little bit. Just a little <laughs> just bit. Just a little bit. Neri's the one who said it, not me. <laughs> Neri's the one who said it, not me. Then you need one-fourth a teaspoon of the baking powder, right? Yeah. We have some more friends online. Say oh. hi to Bob. Hey, Bob. Bob how's it going? Kathy Yeraschak. Hey, Kathy. How's Rachel, it going? Rachel. Ashley Irving Westside. Oh, hey, Ashley. What's up? Okay, so you mix it, right? We're almost done, guys. We are almost done. This is the last thing to do. So we mix this up. We put this in the microwave for 30 seconds. This is the microwave, right? Yep. I don't know. I'm not my kitchen. So, well, wait. Oh, so you just turn the dial? Okay, I don't know. Okay. I'm not going to touch it because I have 30 seconds or 30 to 35 seconds. There I don't know you. how. how I My know. microwave is a press and then uh, there's the numbers. So, you know, if it's not your kitchen, you know, it's a bit <laughs> different, right? Okay, so French toast is done. Woo! Guys, best thing about this though, you can always add peanut butter. You can also add jam. You can also add uh, syrup. Now, because uh, uh, this is zero calorie syrup, you can just drizzle all of this yep. all you it's like. It's guilt free. It's guilt free. And then the chicken is the same thing. We're going to use uh, a dressing. Uh, we'll see. On the side, mm, I think uh, we're going to use Walden. How's that look? Walden Farms. Yes. Yep. There you go. Look at that. Now we're going to get the ice cream. We're going to add that ice cream on top. Once again, I always have Chapman's. <laughs> Chapman's, come on now. Sponsor us, baby. Fit Club's ready. We need it. Come on. We used up all our coupons. <laughs> yeah, we need more. Come on. If you put us on, we're ready to go. Mary's Kitchen. Yes. <laughs> come on. So we get the ice cream. We have a scoop. Scoop, yep. How much? Ah, you know what? Let's see. It says half a cup for 125 milliliters for 120 calories of 7 grams of fat. So... I'm not going to measure this because this is, oh, look, half a cup. Oh, wow. So I'm going to do, you guys are like watching me like a oh, hawk. Because yeah. the thing is, though, <laughs> we have to measure. You have to. You have to be accountable. And even with your peanut butter, I've seen people take heaping tablespoons of peanut butter. Yeah, uh, no, but you know no, what? it's no. a tablespoon. When it's a you tablespoon, gotta you got to weigh it. Yeah. 15 grams. Yeah, nothing 15, more. Yeah, nothing more, nothing less. But for that syrup, oh man, my yeah. goodness, go to Gorilla Jack, buy a lot of those. <laughs> Come on now. Support yeah. your locals, local Winnipeg yeah, here. Now's the time, now to, support the time to support as we are like locked down again. But don't worry, we are doing and we're going to be safe. Look at this on the top. Oh, so it doesn't have that shaker. <laughs> Sheesh. Thank you, RJ. <laughs> I thought like when you do it, it, it looks so good in me. It just makes it look different. <laughs> Damn it. All right, there we go. Okay, that is about it. I'm going to put this on the side. Oh, the ice cream. Ah, give me a spoon. I'm going to okay, put it on. Okay, yeah. I don't want to waste because this is, uh, even though we measured it, it's okay. Here also, you can top this off with a little bit of dark chocolate, a little bit of anything that you want, sprinkles, whatever you like. Okay. I think that's it, right? Perfect, yeah. Okay, I'm going to put this away Okay. on the side. All right, guys, so I'm going to mix this up, and this is what I like to do, okay? I'm going to mix the noodles up. Technically, everything's done. Here's your four meals of the day. And that's a lot of food. And there it is. That's my food that I eat every day. Okay, so just a quick recap. Okay. For breakfast, you'll have... For breakfast, French toast. A French toast with your syrup? That's right, with my syrup, sometimes with peanut butter, sometimes with uh, jam. Okay. okay. Uh, already the egg whites are already in there, so you don't have to add a little bit. And then after that, I have bl uh, dark black... Uh, I have dark... Oh, black coffee. Black coffee, yes, yes. And then, yeah, and then after that, uh, my second meal would, depending on which one I would prefer... If it's going to be a, a, a light day, I'll go for the chicken salad. If it's going to be a, a heavy day, I'll go for the, the noodles with the mix, uh, with the udon That's noodles. That's for lunch? Yeah, okay. either or. Lunch either or, or dinner. Either okay. or. Either or, right? Um, I forgot about one more thing. I bought tomatoes. Just in oh, case. yes, you need the tomatoes. Yes, for that color. Yeah. Each one. You, you can add whatever you like on the tomatoes. Do you wash? You're asking me, the, the truth is I don't. Oh, okay, good. <laughs> I, don't, I don't have time to wash. Okay, good, good. Because I, 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 okay. So anyways, here, here. 
But if you wanted to, you could. You can I, wash. I I, okay. <laughs> That's so, and you can add these uh, here. I usually add it on the salad. You can also eat this on the side. Oh, I know. It's so good. Oh, <laughs> so good. And then you got your sauce. Um, usually, what I do is I measure this too. Um, you don't have to measure it. I don't. I'm not gonna measure this today, okay? Because it's sinful right now. It's 10 calories for two tablespoons, guys. Okay. I measure it still. Okay. Because well, there's carbs in there, right? That is you still correct. You have to keep track so, of everything. So, um, see, Coach Nary yes, is, yes. is Coach Nary. I actually know some stuff too. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Anyways, I'm gonna get. I like using these. So what you do? Put it on. Turn it on. Zero. Okay, and then after that, you measure. Two tablespoons? Yeah. Okay. Thirty-one. That's okay. We got thirty grams. So, voila. That's it. Either or, you can add it on the side, or you can put it on and mix it together. Okay, same thing with the wall. This one's not open, so I'm not gonna, gonna open it. But for Walden's, this is also zero calories, so you can add it onto your salad. And yeah, that's about it. Nair, you, would you like to try? Yes, I which, do. I, which, I'm like ready here. <laughs> which one do you want to try? I want to try this one. Okay, so you want to put the pancake syrup oh, yeah. on? Let me get myself a fork. Yeah, you take two. <laughs> I'm gonna try one too, because I'm so yeah. hungry with this one. By the way, happy Mother's Day, everybody. Oh. Yeah. Happy Guys, Mother's happy Day. Mother's Day. Uh, it's uh, happy Mother's Day, Neri. Happy you. Mother's Day to my wife. Happy Mother's Day to all the mothers out there. My mother-in-law, my own mother. Happy Mother's Day, Mom. I know you're watching this right now. And also to every mother. And also, happy Mother's Day to anybody who has animals. All you puppy fur lovers moms. and uh, fur moms out there. This is all you too as well. Anyways, let's try the French toast out. Okay. Ooh, here she goes. Here I go. I just took a little piece. A little piece. Ooh. Get all that syrup. Mmm. Do they? This syrup is good. Yeah, I want to try it. There, it's, it's zero calories. Let's see. Jerome. Yes, I will. Here you go, buddy. Mm. <laughs> what do you think? Mm. Pretty good, bro. Yeah, man. Yeah, so, the, so this is fourth. Look at this. This is high volume, yes. right? High protein, low carb. Low, low fat. Uh, this is this is set up for you to to eat. You can switch anything up from this too. You don't have to have a salad for the chicken or anything like that. You can add rice. Uh, you don't have to have udon noodles. You can have it with potatoes if you like. Yams if you like. It switches up and mixes everything. I'm gonna have the dessert. You know this all looks so good, and it doesn't look like it's diet food. It looks like regular food, right? It, does. it looks like something that you can actually stick to. I actually want to try some of these noodles. Yeah, you want to put on the sauce on? I no? do, I do. You want to put it on the top? Um, or, uh, just, just, just a little bit. Yeah. Just a little bit. I don't want to go too crazy. Yeah, don't okay. go crazy. All right. Try out. She's like, ah. I just really want the noodles because yeah. I love my carbs. <laughs> I'm going to finish the dessert. Yes, because, finish it. Because uh, I know this is protein. And guess what, guys? I already put this in my fitness pal. There's a little bit of things here, like the salad and everything that I don't know, but 200 grams, I have put it all in together. Mmm. And? I feel like it's a restaurant food. Yep, yeah, yep. Yeah. We can do we can do that, and we can have fun with it. Oh, you can put an egg on top, too, if you want. That's, if you like, egg white, that's all you want. High, a little bit more high protein. I just try to follow with what I got. If you guys want to know what I, how much calories I, I eat, 1,800 to 2,100 is my uh, is what my calorie di diet uh, diet is, and if you want to know how much calories I burn, I burn a lot. How many do you burn? About 3,000 to 4,000 a day, and uh, that's because you guys you think you know who I am, but do you know who I am? So I do He's a lot. Whiz. Yeah, that's why Knocking they call it. Door. Yeah, <laughs> I always got that magic plan. So thank you guys so much. Mm -hmm. If you guys enjoyed this and had fun with us at Neri's Kitchen. Neri, what do you always say? Thanks, guys, for tuning in. Happy, happy Mother's Day, and uh, we'll see you next week. Bye. Bye, guys.